here with uh, Chad from Extreme Hobby and your pilot Yoda from RC Skunk Works. We've got the new A10 that we did a build video on the other night. I'm just taxiing up the other end of the strip. We'll turn around. We've got a crosswind coming from my back, so from the aircraft right there. Full crosswind, not a lot of wind. We've had one fly, uh, just a trimming flight. Everything went really well. Looking forward to the second fly. So I'll just talk you through it, guys. The setup is the same as what Freewing recommends. I've just added a little bit of extra expo on the ailerons just to soften them down a little bit. I love the way it flies. It's so stable. It's beautiful. Let's go. I'll ease the throttle up, keep it straight, wings level, and let's take off. I've got no flap on at the moment. Here we go. I'm holding it straight, letting it accelerate, and letting it lift off. Gear comes up. Like I say, no flap. Just a nice steady climb out, almost scale looking. Let it come back, drop through, accelerate. I'm pretty much hands off there. It's lovely to fly. So that's full throttle. It really gets around. It's very scale in the way it flies. Beautiful straight wing, really good for tight turns, just like the full size one. I'll do a loop from here. So cruising around half throttle now. It looks great, doesn't it? It's nice and big. I'll do an aileron roll. Ooh, holding a little bit of down elevator through that. Nice slow roll. Reasonably slow. Pretty much don't have to touch the sticks. It hasn't got a gyro in it either, guys. It's just lovely to fly. Again, this is only the second flight on it, so I'm just taking it nice and easy. It is called testing. Really, it's got so much aileron control, it's great. So good. Roll rate's crisp. Elevator feels nice too. Yeah, very nice. Flying it with a couple of fairly old batteries of mine too, old uh, Turnergy ones. Heavy duty, 5000s, they're quite heavy, but it's doing it very easily. Plenty of power. We've got the timer set for three and a half minutes. And uh, once that goes off, I'll do the circuit and land. Lovely machine. Inverted, holding probably four or five mil of down stick, down elevator. Doesn't need a lot, it's quite well balanced. It did balance out very easily on the, uh, with the battery bay, it's very big. You can move the battery around. There's plenty of scope to move the C or G, but it balanced straight up, no problem at all. You can hear that round about half throttle on the, on the stick. Doing it so easily. It doesn't have any tendency to roll in or over roll. It's just very gentle. Plenty of elevator. That was only a couple of mil of elevator to pull it out. Really fun to fly. Fast becoming the favourite, I think. Righto, get the gear down, and full flap, and we'll come in from, from the eastern end I think, same direction, and we'll just go straight into circuit there. Full flap, it's got a little bit of down elevator mixed in it, as per the instructions, I haven't changed it. Very, very easy to fly on approach. Already on the elevator there. It's a lovely machine. It um, taxis with only about two mil of throttle too. 
got plenty of torque in those fans. It all works just so easily out of the box. It was about a half an hour build, and you're flying, you're down the field flying, and you haven't had any issues in two flights. It's wonderful. Yeah, it's a lovely machine.